Okay, so you can write distributive property below you write distributive property we can write as this way a into b plus c is equal to a into b c. plus a into c this no definition no this way only you write a into b plus c is equal to a into b plus a into c you can keep this a into b and a into c in another bracket. Okay. Then in case of rational numbers, this distributive property is it true or false? We can check. Now it is distributive property under addition and the same way we can write distributive property under subtraction. Then that is as this way a into b minus c is equal to a into b minus a into c. Miss, upon first one, the first equation is plus addition. Mm, that is for addition. Second one, that is for subtraction. Distributive property under multiplication and addition. That is the first one. Second one, that is under multiplication and subtraction. Okay, we can prove this distributive property for rational numbers by taking any of the three rational numbers. Ma'am? Yes. Uh, should we write this? Uh, I did not hear it was check. Okay, copy that to your notebook. The same way you can copy to your notebook. Give the heading distributive property and below you write a into b plus c is equal to a into b plus a into c and uh, Miss, this all things in page number 30 a box. Ah, okay. In your textbook, you can see. Page number 13. Okay, ma'am. Okay, there you can see one heading. Page number 13 on the top. Distributive property of multiplication over addition and subtraction. For all rational numbers A, B and C. A into B plus C equal to A, B plus A, C. A, B means A into B. A into B minus C is equal to AB minus AC. Okay, so the same way you can copy it to your notebook. Now, we can prove this distributive property for any three rational numbers. So, you take this rational numbers. Now, I take A as 1 by 2. As an example, you can write. 1 by 2 into 1 by 5 plus 2 by 5. We can take. It. 1 by 5 plus 2 by 5. Now, the left side is as this way. A into B plus C. Now, we can take the right side as a into B plus A into C. That way we can check. Okay, so now we are taking the left side. 1 by 2 into 1 by 5 plus 2 by 5. Now, the values in brackets we can do first. 1 by 5 plus 2 by 5, that is 3 by 5. So, here it is 3 by 5. So, we can write 1 by 2 into 3 by 5. So, 1 by 2 into 3 by 5, that is 3 by 10. So, by doing the calculation of left side, we can see that is 3 by 10. Now, we can check the right side. Right side will do A into B plus A into C. Here, 1 by 2 into 1 by 5. Now, we can take A as 1 by 2, B as 1 by 5 and C as 2 by 5. So, A into B plus A into C. A is 1 by 2. A is 1 by 2 and C is 2 by 5. Okay, then first we take the expression of the left side and the next we take the right side. And we can simplify and check the two sides. Is it same or not? Okay, anyone have doubt? Then you can write this way. Now we are taking this 1 by 2 as A. A 1 by 2 in the model. 
1 by 5 ആണ് ഇവിടുത്തെ നമ്മളുടെ B and 2 by 5 is C. Okay, so here it is A into B plus A into C. With the pencil you can write as this way. Then first we take A into B plus C. Next we take A into B plus A into C. ഈ ടു ആൻസറും സെയിം ആണോ എന്നാണ് ചെക്ക് ചെയ്യേണ്ടത് സോ ഫസ്റ്റ് ബ്രാക്കറ്റ് വൺ ബൈ ടു ഇൻറ്റു വൺ ബൈ ഫൈവ് ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് വൺ ബൈ ടെൻ ദെൻ സെക്കൻഡ് ബ്രാക്കറ്റ് വൺ ബൈ ടു ഇൻറ്റു ടു ബൈ ഫൈവ് ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് ടു ബൈ ടെൻ നോ ബൈ ആഡിങ് ദീസ് ടു ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് ഓൾസോ ത്രീ ബൈ ടെൻ ദാറ്റ് മീൻസ് ദ ലെഫ്റ്റ് സൈഡ് ആൻഡ് റൈറ്റ് സൈഡ് ആർ ഈക്വൽ ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് വൺ ബൈ ടു ഇൻറ്റു വൺ ബൈ ഫൈവ് പ്ലസ് ടു ബൈ ഫൈവ് ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് സെയിം ആസ് 1 by 2 into 1 by 5 plus 1 by 2 into 2 by 5. So, this way, any three rational numbers you can take. Okay, positive and negative, that way different type of rational numbers you take and check. Then we can see every time A into B plus C, that is same as A into B plus A into C. Miss? Yes. Miss, how did 3 by 5 come in? Then by adding this 1 by 5 and 2 by 5. values in that bracket we add here the denominator same 5 alle so that are like fractions what is 1 by 5 plus 2 by 5 3 by 10 3 by 10 no 5 if the denominators are same in case of addition we add only the numerators and keep the denominator as the same hmm Miss Petter, no word, no word. Ah, okay. So, you listen. That is 3 by 5. So, that way we can write 3 by 5. Now, yes. you clear? Miss, this distributive can be true in division also? In case of division, that is not true. Okay? It is not true. Only in case yes, of yes. multiplication. Multiplication under addition and subtraction, that is true. But in case of division, that will not be true. Okay. Then every time in case of division, the zero will make some problem. Hmm? Then if we take zero as a rational number, then in between here, 1 by 5 and negative 1 by 5, that will be added to zero. Then 1 by 2 divided by zero, is it possible? No, miss. No. So no, anyway, miss. that will not be true in case of division. division that won't be true all of you clear now by this example yes miss okay this way yes, you can miss. practice different type of rational numbers you take and practice and you check that is true or false okay now we can do some problems by using this distributive property last day we have completed one question what is that in exercise le like, exercise 1.1 in the first question then in last class we have completed by without using this distributive property actually by using distributive property that will be some more easy and uh, there question number 1 uh, and 2 we can complete it by this distributive property that will be some more easy so the question number 1 you can do by distributive property as a homework now we can do the question number 2 here so all of you copy the question number 2 in your notebook as fast petta nelidike the question is this way 2 by 5 into negative 3 by 7 minus 1 by 6 into 3 by 2 plus 1 by 14 into 2 by 5 okay the same question as the same way you can copy which page number Exercise 1.1 in which page? You just check. Page number 14. You just turn your page. You can see page number 14. Exercise 1.1. Okay. From there the main question number 1. Second option. Okay. Copy the question. exercise 1.1 main question number 1 from the second option question is this way 2 by 5 into negative 3 by 
Let's now do that s yes, then minus 1 by 6 then uh, you uh, wait a minute 1 by 6 into 3 by 2 then plus 1 by 14 into 2 by 5 then first of all you check which rational is common here any rational is repeating here you check did you see yes, which two is, by five. Uh, by five. this 2 by 5 is repeating two by five. so you circle that 2 by 5 first with the pencil ok the common rational you circle and uh, we needed to group that to multiplication together so that means these two are together then we can take that 2 by 5 as common up in the end rearrange By commutative property, we can rearrange the values. So, you write the next send, uh, step as this way. 2 by 5. This right okay, copy to your notebook the same way. 2 by 5 into negative 3 by 7. That is the first expression that you give it as the same way. In the last, namaka, these two are, we can interchange. First and second times, we can interchange. Yaya. Okay, apam. In the number of the 1 by 14 plus 2 by 5 in a second item. 1 by 14 times 2 by 5, that is the second expression, and the third expression, second expression, third expression. So 1 by 6 minus 1 by 6 into 3 by 2. That is the number of the third load. In the other property, we are using here we are using commutative property. That means we interchange the expression or otherwise order of the cal, mal, um, order of the operation we interchange okay so we write commutative property here we are using commutative property so you write the property also the which property you applied commutative property By using commutative property, we can interchange or the order of operations. Now, now we can see this 2 by 5 is common. So, here it is of the form A into B plus A into C in the formula. So, the left side of the distributive property you will listen that is A into B plus C. Now, we have common item. Bracket in a very loaded car. So here this 2 by 5 is common. Apa 2 by 5 in a number bracket in a very loaded to a into b plus c in the formula. 2 by 5 common. I keep in it. Even the 2 by 5 at the time back you are the negative 3 by 7. So in first we can write the in the bracket first time is negative 3 by 7 and even the 2 by 5 at the time second time will be another 1 by 14 plus 1 by 14. Okay, so this way we can arrange. Here we are using distributive property. Then it is A into B plus A into C in the formula. That is A into B plus C in the formula. Now we are going to say 7 and 14. Then that two rationals, that two denominators we can convert it in a same LCM 14. Okay, that way we can do the calculation as fast. That is our aim. Now, the, then here one more time is there minus 1 by 6 into 3 by 2. Then there we can cancel. By which value we can cancel? What is the common factor? 3 and 6. Ah, 3 and 6. Okay, this 3 and 6 we can cancel. By 3 we can divide. 3 divided by 3 is 1. 6 divided by 3 is 2. Okay. Now, this expression is 1 into 1 minus 1 into 1 is 1 and the denominator 2 into 2 that is 4. Miss, you stop presenting. Miss, you stop. Okay, wait. Wait a minute. You can't see the presentation now. No, miss. No, no. Okay, no, miss. Sorry, sorry, I will correct it.
okay now it will be the not okay One minute. No, miss. No. No. Okay, wait a minute. Okay, then my sometime my video is on. I don't like it. Okay, now I think one minute. Now it's okay. Okay, so you listen. Then up to this time you didn't see. Okay, so listen once more. Then from the starting I will say here 2 by 5 into negative 3 by 7 minus 1 by 6 into 3 by 2. And 1 by 14 into 2 by 5. Here we can see the 2 by 5 is common. So we can interchange these two times. E and the time would interchange. Him. Okay. Up 1 by 14 into 2 by 5 number second time item. 1 by 6 into 3 by 2 third time item. In here, this 2 by 5 is common. Up 2 by 5 in a common item. Then in brackets, here is first time will back you the negative 3 by 7. Second time will back you the 1 by 14. And this 1 by 6 and 3 by 2 we can cancel. That is by 3 we can cancel. So here 2. So 2 times 2, 4. So that is 1 by 4. Now all of you write this much. Yes, yes. yes. Okay. So you listen. Now we can complete. Then this 2 by 5. And in this bracket. Then here what is the LCM of 7 and 14? 14. 14. 14. So we can multiply this 7 ne matra namaku 2 want to multiply the 14 agum. 14. Ah, uh, minus 3 into 2 now that is minus 6 by 14 nagum. Minus 6 by 14 into sorry plus 1 by 4. Minus 6 by 14 plus 1 by 4. 1 by 14. Not 1 by 4, 1 by 14. Okay, then minus 1 by 4. Minus 1 by 4. Now, minus 6 plus 1, what is that? Negative 5. Ah, okay, so 2 by 5, bracket in the belly, 2 by 5. Then, into minus 5 by 14. Because minus 6 is 1 over add either, minus 5. Okay, then 1 by 14. Then, minus 1 by 4. Okay, now, this 5 and 5 we can cancel. Yes, miss. Okay. Yes, miss. So this 5 and 5 we cancel. The 5 divided by 5 is 1. Negative 5 divided by 1 is negative 1. Okay. Then this 2 and 14 we can cancel. 2 divided by 2 is 1. 14 divided by 2 is 7. Okay. Then we can answer the answer. 1 into negative 1. That is negative 1 divided by 1 into 7 7 then last to 1 by 4 on the minus 1 by 4 okay we end up with a window number simplify now. okay negative 1 by 7 minus 1 by 4 what is LCM of 7 and 4 28 28 28 7 and number 4 on the multiply now if they number 4 on the multiply do and here this 
4 we can multiply with 7. So here also multiply with 7. So up in the minus 1 by 4. Minus 1 and 4 we multiply that is minus 1 by 4. Sorry minus 4 divided by 28. Minus 4 divided by 28. Then minus 1 into 7. 7 divided by 28. Okay by doing minus 4 minus 7. How can we write? Hmm? Negative 4 by 28 plus negative 7 by 28. Ah yes. Then we can change the sign of the second number and add with the first. Up in the room. Negative 4. Negative 4 by 28. Then sign mighty add. If you have positive 7, that is sign mighty plus negative 7 by 28. Okay, negative 4 by 28 plus negative 7 by 28. That is equal to negative 11 by 28. Then that is the least form because 11 is where factors 11 is a prime number. So the answer is negative 11 by 28 is the last answer. It is not that much easy one. Now I think all of you clear all that steps. Okay. Here yes. we are applying distributive property. Because 2 by 5 is common. That 2 by 5 we can take as outside. Apo nengal vayana ke libada distributive property namla use idha pam. A im idha namla da a a into b plus a into c. Idha ana a ya. The c. Okay, vada varim pam. It is a and this one is b and it is c. Ibara order onde change karche idha ana karna vayana ke lidhe na vinto nengal ka. A into C in the formula, we will write a step in the same Or otherwise, you think A into C and C into A, that two are same. Because here, commutative property. That is why we will write a distributive property. In this step, we will apply the distributive property. So, here you write distributive property. Okay. Then all of you copied and anyone have doubt here, you please ask. Miss, who all want to send notes today? Ah, okay, okay. I will say. Then, 